welcome to Tarantulas with Shanti. It is Monday, October 29th, and Halloween is Wednesday. So I have changed into a vampire. Uh, so this is my Monday update, and I want to keep my Monday updates interesting for you, not just me talking. So I've decided that I'm going to include a couple clips. Um, I'm going to rehouse my little zebra jumping spider. Um, I think that's called Salticus Senecus. And I'm going to um, show you a couple of my Arrhenius diadematis, uh, how I feed them. Um, however, they're, they're really not, uh, they're kind of hit and miss as to whether or not they do a takedown. And I'm going to rehouse my Harpactera pulcherpes, my larger um, of the two uh, golden blue leg baboons that I have. Um, this is my confirmed female. And so I'm going to do that for you. There is going to be a challenge um, in the, the Tarantula YouTube community. And this is going to be put on by Bug Realms and Tarantula TV. So if you know Sam over at Bug Realms, go and check out his channel or Tarantula TV to learn more about this. It's going to be kind of like the deathmatch or um, off of Tong's challenge that Tom Moran and Mark, Mark's Tarantulas had. Except for the entire Tarantula YouTube community is participating, pretty much, whoever wants to. And we will be just doing this for fun and people can vote for the best takedowns and it's going to be pretty epic. So um, I really want to put a shout out to Sam at Bug Realms for all the time and energy that he's putting into this project. I mean, he's busy. He's a, he's a dad. He works, you know, he, he has a lot going on, has his YouTube channel. It's just whew, a lot and it's really wonderful of him to do this. And as you can see, I'm filming from my bedroom today um, and you can hear some pounding in the background. I'm having windows put into this back room that I have, which is really exciting. Uh, my boyfriend uh, moved in um, a little while ago and we're fixing up the back uh, family room so that we have that extra space for, you know, TV room and stuff. Uh, usually I don't watch a lot of TV, so you know, this kind of gives us a second space and, you know, we'll have more room to, you know, if we want to have friends over, that sort of thing. So that's what all that noise is. And that's pretty exciting. I'm, I'm very thankful for that. So that's a, that's a very good thing that's happening. Uh, and other than that, I mean, everything's been good here with my tarantulas. I made the spider mask. You can see part one. I'm going to make part two where I just paint. Um, paint one of them and I'm going to use the the more difficult mask as the example when I paint it and just show you the one that would just traditionally hang on the wall or maybe a child could wear it um, and the second mask in that video was actually the easier one to make and that's the one that I, I recommend you try to make for, for Halloween or you know in case you're going to go to some kind of a uh, masquerade or you know if you go to New Orleans you could make your own Mardi Gras spider mask it would be really cool anyway um, other than that I don't really have a lot to update nothing super exciting has happened except for these rehouses that I'm gonna share with you so I hope that you enjoy them and have a wonderful week